singing my song. Just It's been real a long time. Yeah. I would say it's February. The pandemic has has been horrible. We look at the deaths across the world, over 100,000 deaths in America. Um, but in some ways, it's been quite of a revelation. This documentary is about making space. I want to make space for you and your stories. I want to make space for laughter and the sweetest memories. I want to make space for us to grieve. I want to make space for tears and sadness. You would say child now, brown cow, or so. <laughs> <laughs> I you would say after the wall, crack and all, and then I'd say see you later. <laughs> move. I just say she just moved her residence. Mm, I from love her. Her home to, to, to her heavenly home. So, um, yeah, she meant a lot to me. It was like a subject. So. Like, during the pandemic, I had nightmares about being at the hospital by myself as a black woman and not being believed. I want to talk to everybody. I want to talk to you. Now that we, we just didn't lose a loved one. We have lost a piece of ourselves in this. When the pandemic hit, I had other vulnerable population of people coming to my support where I was just like overwhelmed with, it, it, it was 100% a community effort. Uh, that, like all of that just, the, adjust, the adjustment period, there were some very, very dark days. Um. But I also want to make space for possibilities. All we have to do is keep holding on. And he will re reveal some things to us that we didn't even think was possible. But we said when it comes down to man, you could say an, an impossible God to them, but it's possible with the Almighty. As people of faith, is a reflection of our understanding of who Christ is and our understanding of our responsibility while we're on this time of life, time side of life. Put out a statement saying like, you know, stay home if you have to stay home like this. We still had like our member yeah. was 104 still came. And so that was pretty, <laughs> like, oh, wow. we're trying to advise you all, but you all are gonna do what you feel led to do. And especially when it comes to faith, you know, the faith over fear. Um, narrative mm. that you're going, people are like, well, I'm going to just do it. I have made space for you. I have made room for your stories. And I hope that you will join me in this documentary. Black Experiences with COVID-19 Media Morning this documentary to my lovely grandmother, Rosalie Zeno, who graduated on March 17th, 2020. Thank you for the opportunity. <laughs>